Good morning, guys. It is Saturday morning, October 29th, and it is 10 o'clock in the morning. I am actually going to vlog for you guys today because I have a super, super, super busy day. Like, I made my to-do list this morning, and there's just... You, when you write a to-do list and before you even get started on your day, you know, yeah, there's no chance I can get all this done in one day. But you know what? I'm going to get as much as I can done today, and I'm going to take you guys along for the ride because I haven't filmed a day in the life in a really long time. So I'm sitting outside right now waiting for my husband to come out to the car because we are going up to... My car is making you guys shake all over the place. Hold on. Maybe that's better. Um, we are going up to our church to help them film a video that they're going to be sharing. Um, they're doing a video of all of the... Well, not all, but some of the teachers who work at our church are coming up to, to be a part of a video. So that's what we're on our way to do. We're supposed to be there at 1030. So I really hope he hurries. So I just figured I would take you guys along with me for the day because I got a whole lot going on and I just wanted to share. So you guys stay tuned. with our filming at the church. What did you, how did you feel about it, honey? Uh, I enjoyed it. It's always good to, uh, and guess what, your testimony? Yeah. People, a lot of people on my channel say that they, they ask me, why don't we ever see your husband in the vlogs anymore? Not that I vlog very frequently, but. Because I'm not a vlogger. He's not a vlogger. I'm not um, a vlogger. The answer, and I've answered before, is just that he's not usually around when I'm vlogging. That's the only reason, because when he is around, he there, he has a cameo appearance. We did this video. My wife's over there all big balling it, just looking like a professional. <laughs> and I'm like sweating and scared. He's wearing a sweatshirt, to be fair. That's not the reason. And we were sitting under some lights. I you was know. nervous. I'm very nervous. Yeah, I'm... And I even got choked up. I have a little bit more experience talking to a camera. Not that they knew that. That's they did, nice. They My wife did, talks to herself all the time. Yeah, I talk to her. No, I don't talk to myself. I talk to a camera. I talk to 7,000 people. So if I just took my phone out and just kept it up. And there you go. Them. You just need practice. Okay. Um, they didn't. They do not know the, um, that I have a YouTube channel, so they had no idea that I have some experience um, sitting, sitting in front of a camera and talking. But regardless. We are on our way back home now, and it's a very bumpy road, so you guys are doing this and I really can't stand all over voice. the place. He says he can't stand the sound of his voice. You guys will totally understand that, because how many people hear a recording of themselves, and they go, ugh, is that really what I sound like? Ugh. <laughs> Most people are like that. I was like that when I first started my channel, but at this point, I'm so used to hearing myself on videos that it doesn't even phase me anymore. It doesn't bother me at all. If you're not used to it, though, I know it gets on some people's nerves. If you don't like my voice, please give it two thumbs up. <laughs> they can only give it one thumbs up. Oh, and sorry. who's realistically going to say that they don't like the sound of your voice? Somebody who's really incredibly mean. You can get her a crown. Oh, please don't. <laughs> so we are at um, Dollar Tree. We are looking for pieces to finish off the girls' costumes. Is it? It's Elsa chain. Keychain. Elsa keychain. That's not what we came here to find. So yeah. We're looking for costume stuff. We already went to Walmart. Have, like, Look at this. Look how cute this is. Look at this. Tiny little bottles of coffee creamer. That's so funny. That is exact ooh, it looks look at what it looks like on the bottom. Is that what it always looks like? This is so totally what I need to take with me to, to when we go to co-op. I don't know. This looks funny. Does that look? Does that look normal? I don't know about all that. Anyway, what were you asking me? Do they have like regular black headbands? Mm, we'd have to look in the hair section. Where's the hair section? Beats me. So anyway, we went over here, Camry. We went to Walmart and picked up a few things. I needed a few things because I'm gonna be filming some videos for you guys today. And then the girls needed a couple things. So here's the hair stuff. Oh, the 
That's a lot of hair stuff. So that's what we're up to. We're about to go home. No, we're gonna go to the bank and then we're gonna go home after we leave here. Yep, but I figured I would update you guys. There's a lot of stuff. Here, well this isn't a regular headband. It's more like what you normally wear, a head wrap. Well, I need a headband because I was gonna cut out ears. Okay. Since I'm being um, red. I don't know, we'll see. I mean, there's Facebook this morning that I was going to be filming a day in the life and I asked if there was anything specific that you guys would like to see and I'm so glad that some of you actually shared with me um, because I wasn't really sure what you wanted to see so one of the things that y'all said you wanted to see was cooking and truth be told I just spent about two hours cooking in my kitchen but you're not gonna see it in this video because I was actually pre filming some videos that are gonna be coming later on my channel but I do have some stuff coming for you guys, don't worry. Um, I think you're gonna like it. It's, I made some really good stuff today. So, I did cook today. You're not gonna get to see it for just a little while longer, sorry, but I did cook today. And then um, I had someone ask how I keep my littlest children, my youngest children entertained while we do homeschool with the older two. And the truth of the matter is, I started out this school year not really sure myself how I was going to do that. Um, I had a plan in mind, but it kind of fell apart. Cause let's be honest, my two and a half year old is not going to sit still long enough for me to do school with my older kids. She really is just, she's a distraction. And that's just not because of her as a person, but because of the fact that she is two years old. And it took me a little bit of time, but I finally got to a point where I could accept that she is just going to be a distraction. And I could look at it and say, you know what? This is a season. I've talked about this so many times on my channel. This is a season, you know, this is the, this is the part of our lives that we're in right now. And, um, you know, next year when we do homeschool, she'll be three and a half and she will be able to participate a little bit more, but she still won't be old enough to really sit down and do school for any length of time. Um, you know, I mean, to be honest with you, that's just the way that it is. So what we do with her in order to keep her busy is I literally let her make a complete and total mess out of her bedroom. She pulls out her, she has a toy box that is basically just a big, um, I think they're called Sterilite, the brand. It's not Tupperware, it's not Rubbermaid, but it's a brand of a tote that you buy at Walmart. She has a really big one and I pull, it's it's not like overflowing with toys because I clean it out pretty frequently 
but she has lots of toys in it. She also has a, her play kitchen in her bedroom. She has baby dolls. And so I pull out her toy box and I just let her play, you know, and she will play for as long as she can um, keep herself entertained. We also turn on educational DVDs for her. Every now and then I'll let her watch Disney Junior. Um, we let her color. We do, you know, I read books to her. Pretty much anything and everything we can do with her in order to keep her entertained and still feeling like she's not left out. That's probably the hardest part is that if I, and this goes with either of my two youngest kids because my son is old enough that he does school for a while um, in the mornings with his sisters, but then he has time that he goes and he plays in his room as well. Um, but the hardest part is probably just making sure that my two youngest ones don't feel left out when I'm trying to do school with my oldest two. But that's not, let me, with that being said, I need my two youngest kids to, to know, to accept and understand that it's not all about them. They cannot be the only ones who get my attention. And so they have to learn to accept that sometimes mommy's attention will be on big sisters. Um, that's not always easy for them, but it is something that we strive to teach our kids. So unfortunately, I don't have any genius ideas that are just going to be like mind blowing. Um, my biggest piece of advice for moms who are kind of going through the same thing is just do what you got to do. You do what you got to do to make it through the days. And above all else, remember that this is a season this, it will not always be this hard. You know, next year I will have a 10th grader, an eighth grader, a second grader, and Kyler will be three and a half. Um, the year after that, you know, they get older and they get older. Eventually Kyler will be, you know, in pre-K and kindergarten and in first grade. And it helps me to remember that this is the hardest it should be with her. And last year it was harder Maybe not, maybe last year it wasn't harder because she was only about one and a half. She wasn't quite into the terrible twos. Um, this is a hard year. This is a really hard year. Um, but next year it'll get a little bit easier. And the year after that, it'll get a little bit easier. And so I just have to keep telling myself that um, and doing what we gotta do to make it through the day. So that's my advice on that situation. And so now you guys are gonna get to see some fun stuff going on around our house today. It's coming off that end, not the other one. Just keep walking, bud. Yeah. Kyler, turn around, let mommy see your costume. Who are you? Are you Elsa? Are you big girl or baby? Who are you, bubs? Captain America. Captain trip. America. All right, let's keep walking. Okay, so we are walking down the, the road here to some friend's house so the kids can hang out for a little while. Aren't they cute? Yep. Go ahead, keep walking, baby. You doing good? Thank you. Thanks, we try. Thanks. <laughs> you ready to have some fun, princess girl? You gonna have some fun? How are you, Miss D? That's it. Got some Okay, where's Hattie? Yeah, that's probably not oh, cow. Oh, oh, you're losing your dress, baby. I think that I'm yeah. just going to make my pumpkin hey, don't one Don't give giant. Hattie any candy. One. She would not give me any candy. Two. Two. You're welcome. A pencil? What'd Where's you it? get? A pencil. Oh, I love that's it. That's all you can pencils. see it. I bet there's other good stuff in there. Yeah, there's like goods. Mm -hmm. There's a whiskers. Yeah. There's a whiskers. Wait, whiskers? Let me see what you got going on, Ryan. These are really. Tyler, what did you get? What did you get? That. What's in it? What's in it? Pumpkins. That's what's in it. <laughs> so these um, kids are decorating pumpkins. Hey, Ryan. Ryan, show me your pumpkin that you decorated. <laughs> that is so cute. It's very creative. I like it a lot. Do you like it? Yes, I do. It's very cute. Tyler, are you going to go on the hayride? Yes. Grant, are you going to go on the hayride? I love your costume. Are you going to go on the hayride? Yeah. 
with your teenage wow. girl hair. There? She's I'm all like, you're gonna fall off. <laughs> you guys are gonna fall off. We are not gonna fall off. <laughs> are we going on a hayride? I'm going on, I thought you were taking a picture. Yeah. No, you're like. Yes, we're going. On showing a me your non-double chin. Belinda. <laughs> we're going on a hayride. <laughs> going on a hayride. Little Missy's first hayride, isn't it, baby? Are you excited? This is a middle Yes. Say hi. Cheese. Say hi. Hi. What are we watching? Um, Say Aggies. Yes. Are you watching Aggies? Yes. Me. Yes. No. Are you silly? No. No. Nose. nose. She's trying to show you guys her nose. 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 No, no, no. Don't touch. Show that way. Go show that way. Show the game. Show that way. Show daddy. Show daddy. Hi. Show Rari. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to close out the vlog. Um, I've shared quite a bit of our day with you guys, but we are going to uh, get climbed on by a small child. We are going to put this one in bed pretty soon. Are you ready to go night night? Yes. Yes. And then um, I'm going to finish watching this game, and I'm going to go to bed because I'm exhausted. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Did you have fun tonight? Yes. What did you get to do? Um, Pack. You did what? Play. Play? Yes. What else did you do? Uh, did you get to go on a hayride? Huh? Yes. Did you get candy? Yes. Yes. Was it fun? Yes. Yes. All right. So I hope you guys have enjoyed following along on us on, on our journey today. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you did. Make sure to hit the red subscribe button before you go. And we will see you guys soon. Say bye. 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 Running. Say bye. 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 bye.